In this video, we'll write the balanced net ionic equation for Ki plus Na2CO3. This is potassium iodide plus sodium carbonate. First thing we need to do, we need to balance the molecular equation. So we see we have one potassium here and two here. So let's just put a two in front of the potassium iodide. Now we have two iodine atoms, put a two here, and that balances the molecular equation. Now we need to write the states for each substance. Potassium compounds are very soluble if you know your solubility rules. So we're going to write AQ. That's going to be aqueous. It'll dissolve, dissociate into its ions. Sodium compounds, very soluble. AQ for aqueous. Again, another potassium compound that's going to be aqueous. And sodium, aqueous. And you can see at this point, everything is aqueous. So what will happen is if we split this all up into its ions and then we cross out the spectator ions, We'll cross everything out because we'll have this all split into ions, same here. And when we cross it out, we'll end up with nothing. That means that there is no reaction here. We don't actually have a reaction take place. No precipitates are formed. Just you mix these up, they stay mixed. This is Dr. B looking at a net ionic equation for Ki plus Na2CO3, but there isn't one. So we say there's no reaction. Thanks for watching.